Hey, how you doing today, folks? Um, do a quick little clip for the customers on the new DMM Hitch Climber Pulley, the Eccentric. Um, just to kind of explain the the basic uh, differences between this and the regular Hitch Climber Pulley. I mean, first off, you can see there's a bit more mass, a bit more bulk to it. Um, first off, this pulley has a top and a bottom, so it's got a little bit of a an arrow teardrop shape there. If you can see that, that's going up and they actually have an arrow on there to help folks like myself. The other thing you'll notice is the bottom is really flared out. What that's going to do is just when you're tending slack, it's going to put that rope right into the shiv on the pulley, reducing friction, making it easier for you to push the prussic up and tend your, tend your slack and gain the progress that you gained. Um, and if you look at the two pulleys there, you can see how much more, there's a lot more room in the eccentric than there is in the traditional hitch climber pulley. Uh, slightly higher uh, minimum brake strength, working load limit on the eccentric. Uh, the one other major difference is I've got the regular hitch climber in my hand. The center hole, sorry, the center hole isn't out as far as it is on the regular hitch climber. Haven't gotten to climb with this yet. I literally just got it yesterday. I just wanted to do a quick video, explain some other you know, differences between the two. Another thing is this has a, a bearing, not a bushing on the shiv of the pulley. So it is gonna be a, what's considered a high efficiency pulley. Um, design wise, I, I see why they made the changes that they made. There's gonna be a lot less friction on ascent because the rope's not gonna be rubbing on the on the side plates and the front of the side plates as much as it could with the regular hitch climber pulley. So that's the DMM eccentric available at Westbury Tree Equipment.